the victory is then having the conversation, exchanging those words, communicating with a player, I don't like that, cut it out. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. In this clip, um, I as the referee make a, a call uh, in favor of red and then a blue player who's going by me says something well with an earshot of me um, expressing his dislike of the call or something. I, he said something to kind of get under my skin. So I do the double whistle, beep beep, and then I, you know, motion for him to come over or something and I address it. So um, for newer referees, the victory, guys, is not what you say to the player, it's that you decide, I don't like that. I'm stopping that. I'm going to address that. And the victory is then having the conversation, exchanging those words, communicating with the player, I don't like that, cut it out, all right? Keep it to yourself, all right? Whatever, but it's some sort of you letting the player know that that's not okay and that you want to put out that little brush fire quickly, okay? You want to address the brush fire, okay? So for newer referees, guys, it's not, shoot, what am I going to say? Is it going to be perfect? Blah, blah, blah. Guys, it's not going to be perfect. But it's that you choose to address it first. You, you make the choice. And secondly, that you say something, okay? You get your message across. I don't like this. Stop, right? However, whatever you want to say to get the message across, get the message. And in younger games, or maybe, I don't know, kind of around, I don't know, like boys start getting competitive around, you know, you know, they, or maybe they, they start getting mouthy around, you know, definitely U15s, maybe like U13 and 14, kind of right in that area. Um, you, you can start doing that. And maybe it's not necessary for the game, but in those games where you got it under control, you can practice doing that so that in the... U17, 18s, 19s, you know, U23s, whatever, in those upper level games where it's much more competitive, you have the experience of doing it at the younger levels, so you're more confident and more used to um, it, and it might make it go smoother than um, in the upper age groups. So thanks for watching, we'll see you in the next one.